Your boy, JC the official man, and I'm back with another banger, man. Hey, I got another glitch video for y'all. Hey, this Dan Dan bro video, so I'll put his link in the description. But hey, man, y'all finna learn how to shoot these greens, man. Hey, let's get straight into the video though. No count. If you guys don't like and subscribe in the next five seconds, these big ass kukurachas will actually crawl up in your mouth. I wouldn't risk it if I were you guys. If you guys need your badges right now on 2K21, go ahead and go to plug for badges and accounts. Trust me guys, they're 100% legit. If you guys need your badges done within a couple of days, they got you. Again, their links and everything will be in the description guys. If you guys need cheap and reliable MT on NBA 2K21, go hit up mtstacks.com, go to the website, buy MT for any console you guys want, use my code DAN for 5% off. Again, their links will be in the description guys. We'll turn back. I'm posting a fat minute, but today I'm going to show you guys the green light mod, the green light glitch, the instant green light, whatever. I just press one button, no matter what the contest is, no matter if I'm fading, catch and shoot, I get a green every single time. I'm ready to show you guys clips. I just press one button, and you guys can match up what I'm doing right now, and I literally match up, right? I just press one button, and I get a green every single time. So again, you guys do need to buy something, but it's really, really cheap if you guys go for the cheapest one, which is like $15, $20. So again, go ask your mom right go to gamestop go buy it and then go back to this little video but again it's very simple how to set it up i'm gonna show you guys how to do it i'm gonna show you guys more proof right in the mic or show sure you guys proof it does work it's actually 100 percent now again i think you guys have been seeing people in the park on doing and stuff like that now i've been had one of these for uh maybe two or three years all right so again i didn't just get this i've been had one i'm not gonna say i've been using it but again i've used it ever since it got popular again for some reason but again if any devs are listening right now because i know devs love to watch my videos for some reason to ban me but if you're watching my videos right now the only way to patch this is if you guys take shot aiming off now if you guys see right here in the video i literally just press one button i get a green so back to the video again but all i do is just press one button and i get a green so here i'm gonna shoot from really really deep i press the button bam get a green doesn't matter if i'm fading doesn't matter if i'm doing this and that now let's just say i want to change the timing because again 2k might patch this or 2k might do this and that so right here if you guys do notice when you hold your l2 button if you guys had this already hold your l2 button and press the d-pad left or right now the right is to go to the right and the left is to go to the left so again if you guys see it more to the right you just press l2 you know arrow to the left and then just fix that little timing thing now i left also the script or i guess the green light mod or glitch or whatever so if anybody wants to use it go ahead all right i have a link for free people are actually charging people for this little thing i don't know why but i'm also going to show you guys how to how to basically set it up if you guys do have the same one i have now the one that's 20 bucks to 15 bucks that one's a little bit different but it's the same way it works the same way it just doesn't have as many features as the one i do have so again if you guys are wondering about the 15 or 20 dollar one i don't know how to set it up but i do have the file for that one so if you guys do want it Go right under the pinned comments or in the description. I will have a link to that. So just download that. Put it onto that little $20, I guess, mod pack or whatever it's called. And boom, you're done. You guys should have it. Basically, just got to press one button. For you, I think it's a little paddle. For me, it's L1. Again, it's different for whatever, which one you guys do have. Now, if you guys do notice, whenever you miss, stay in my course for a little bit. But whenever you guys do miss, whenever it says slightly right or slightly left, Fix the timing a little bit and you guys should be fine if you guys are wondering if you're missing a little bit or you're missing that this and that so how to set up is very very easy i'm gonna go into my desktop and show you guys what to do so once you guys have the, i guess you know whatever which one you have i have the corona's max so now i'm gonna show you guys how to set it up so let's just test it out very simple how to do or how to put the files into the little thing so here just click on any of these right here the free ones that you guys see on the website just click right here and then click download once you guys click download go into the file thing right here it should give you those little like letters and stuff right here in the text messages go into file and then click save once you guys click save 
rename this to whatever you guys really want to so just put test because again we're just testing this out to see 100 percent does work for you guys to do so click save now once you've done, done that very simple head into where it says programmer now once you guys are in programmer very simple look for the file you guys just saved from the website now again it might be maybe um refresh so again just restart the little app thing and then just come back to programmer go into your documents or your downloads or whatever right wherever it's at so again i try to look for it on my desktop i couldn't find it so i'm assuming it's in my uh documents so i just went to my download first and then it wasn't there went to my documents it was there so again it should be named it should pop out like pretty easy all right so here i go into my downloads nothing's really there so i go into my documents and you guys should see right there all in the end it says you know testing.gpc or whatever it's called very simple just drag and drop that folder or a file into that number one two or three four slot and then click on program device then press ok let the little thing you know do its thing and that's it you're done so now once you guys copy down the folder this and that very simple unplug that usb right or whatever you guys have the strike pack or the corona max or the zen or whatever unplug it plug it onto your ps4 and really that's it just gotta plug in a usb onto the Cronus Max or the Zen or whatever, and it should connect to you as a controller, right? And then when you guys use it, you guys just press L1 and that's it. Now it's gonna reset for me, a reset in the video. So here I've unplugged it, bam, I plugged it in. I'm gonna press X. And now here for some reason, it's gonna reset it. So every time you guys log into 2K or your PS4 restarts or resets or whatever, what I want you guys to do very simple is just, you know, fix the timing. So again, how to fix the timing is very simple. Hold your L2 button, right? And then click basically your left arrow to go left or to go right. All right. So again, keep trying to you guys fix it or until you guys get it right. Now, again, it's kind of complicated how to explain this. I tried to explain it the best thing I could. But once you guys done that testing file and you guys see it does work or whatever, again use my file and do the exact same thing as in the video it's very simple all right i'm gonna explain you guys real quick on how i did it again you know if anybody is confused or something like that so again you go on to basically my file you download it right you download my file from the little description or in the pinned comments take that little file and just drag it into the programmer like i guess folder thing and program the device and then bam, you're completely done. It's not even that hard of a to do or something that hard. You guys saw on the thing where I was doing it, it's pretty simple. You just drag a file onto the little USB thing where it says one, two, three, four, five. Program the device, press OK, let it do its thing, and bam, you're done. You unplug it, plug it onto your PS4, connect it to your controller, and that's it. Then you guys just press one button and you guys get an instant green every single time. Now, I hope they patch this because it's really, really annoying to play against or to do this and that. Because again, I don't know if 2K's realized this or not, but this is really broken. I hope they do fix it. I hope any devs listen to this video right now and still listening right now. Please, I hope you guys do fix this. The only way to fix it is if you guys remove shot aiming. That's the only way to patch this. You really can't do anything about it. You can't make the timing different every single time you guys log in. You can't just in that because, again, I could just go back into my core or in park and just fix it. So the best option, if I were you guys making this little, I guess, devs watching this little video or something like that, please just take out shot aiming and you guys should be fine because i know for a fact in ps5 please don't make shot aiming again because again i know this little strike pack or the zen or whatever is gonna work for next gen so again if you guys are watching this little video most likely they won't patch this on current gen but on next gen they for sure will patch it maybe i don't really know but again i'm out y'all peace